first of all, I look for people that are intellectually curious. When I'm having an interview with someone, I'll say, don't talk about your work. Let me just page through it. I've seen 600,000 portfolios. What are you reading as I'm paging through the portfolio? Recommend a CD that I should be listening to as I'm paging through the portfolio. I see a lot of good work out there. And for me, it's more about the rapport I'm going to have with an individual. I want to hear what's intellectually stimulating for them. Tell me something I, some, something new. Let's not talk about typefaces. Tell me something else. Those kinds of conversations really tell me who the person is, not the designer. If there's anything I encourage with students, interns, is to not be so myopic about the world of design. Because the world of design is a mere speck in life. And I think it's those bigger issues that contribute to your sensibilities about design. That's the thing that I urge designers or young designers, students, to see the world in that way. Much, much broader than what we see on the design blogs or in the design magazines or in the design books. Because I think it's just too narrow of a world. <laughs>